The majority of people who watch my channel aren't British, so you won't know how cold it is here unless you are here. Now, I love winter and I'm really excited for Christmas, but I could do with a holiday. I have just been aware, but it was somewhere cold. So I could do with a beach holiday. So I'm going to do it in The Sims 1. We're going to go explore the beachfront for a while. We're going to even try and have a little bit of a holiday romance. And I'm fairly sure all of the families that go on holiday in The Sims Vacation are families, but I don't mind breaking up a family for a bit of holiday romance. So just a quick intro. Let's jump into it. We could just move into a field. It doesn't matter. We're going straight on holiday anywhere. But speaking of which, this is Holly Day. Because yes, I am that creative. And all you need in your house is a hay bale and a crappy old phone because we are getting straight out of town. We are sick of the winter. Call cab, go on vacation. Thank you for calling Vacation Island Tours. Would you like to take advantage of our current island getaway package? Yes, I would actually. That was very quick. No one's even asked me to see my fucking passport. But this is an absolute tune. I'm loving it. So first things first, I'm heading straight to the large hotel, the Palazzo Palms Hotel. As an island historian, historic landmark, the Palazzo Palms Hotel has a rich and colourful heritage and attracts a rich and colourful crowd. Check it out when you check in. I love that so much more because I was loving the music while I was reading it. Here we are, straight to the toilet, you stinky bitch. What's wrong with you? Your bladder's fine. Stop. Let's go check in. Who's that? I heard a man. Andrew, <laughs> I'm not going to check in yet. Talk about interests. Is that your wife you're talking to? Oh, you're not even talking to her. You're full on ignoring her. You can't really tell because of all the things blocking the way. But Andrew, I'm nicking you. I'm going to move though because I can't really see what's going on here. Let's go inside. Where am I going? Why am I so desperate to go to the toilet? Why am I so desperate to go to this specific toilet? It's the furthest one away. I can use any of these rooms. So yeah, the thing about The Sims 1 when you went on vacation is that when you checked in, you could access every single room. You didn't have a specific room to stay in. So the only thing I can't do right now is sleep. So I'm going to check in since I've already lost my best Andrew. Hello, do you mind if I just talk to you in silence and you also talk to me in silence? De Des Clerk Claudette. Thanks for choosing to stay with us. We value your patronage and hope you enjoy our award-winning service. Please be courteous and check out promptly in the morning. I'll be doing no such thing. On either count, I won't be courteous, I won't be checking out. Oh, she's going straight on the slide. I've not even told us to do that. All right. Oh, stop going to the furthest thing away. Why are you going to that slide? What's wrong with the other one? Cheeky little cameo from Marky Sharky over here. Oh. <laughs> She did not handle the slide well. Oh, Andrew, are you following me in? All right, I'll let you. There are no actions available. Get me out of this pool then. Andrew, can you get out too? Yes. Look at those little skimpy things you've got on. Come over here. I am flirting straight away. He's loving it. Right, I'm doing... I'm going to growl at you because I feel like that's the most appropriate thing to do when you first met someone. There's a really good way to get onto someone's good side. Oh, we met a new family friend. Already. I lost the family friend because I gossiped about someone that I've never met before. I don't know why. Okay. The growl that I did feels not as awkward considering the weird sounds you just made then. Where are you now? There you are. And a little peck. I think we're ready. Where's your wife, by the way? I want her to see this. Oh, we lost him as a friend in the meantime. I didn't even notice that happened. Okay, I've got a crush, but she's just left. <laughs> she straight up just left him to do whatever he was doing. Where am I going? Oh, to play on these games. So this is something I never really did as a kid because I didn't find it very fun. Because I thought you were just playing these games for the sake of playing them. But it turns out you can use them here to buy things. But I don't remember what I can buy. So let her play this one and then we'll see. Let her just stand for ages, not doing anything. Then we'll go see. Holly, please. Okay, she's going. Doing a terrible job of it as well. What about if you smack this? Come on, you've got this. You've got zero body skill, but it doesn't matter apparently. Six tickets. Tokens? Whatever they're called. Oh, don't make me look at them individually. I can't be asked. Chicken cookie jar. 115 tokens. Absolutely fucking not worth it. Baby doll. Let's get something creepy. 85 simoleons. Right, I'm doing that. Not simoleons. Tokens. Tickets. I don't care what they're called. I'll just keep playing this one. She's doing quite well on this, actually. I've got 141 tokens already. Give me that baby doll. Right now, it sounds terrifying. <laughs> well, I don't know what to do with that. I can't put it out until I get home, but I guess I'll just collect as many baby dolls as possible, and that'll be a good indicator of how well we've done on holiday when we get home. I've just pissed my money away on three different meals then, because they don't fill you up at all. What I am going to do, though, is let a hygiene drop, and I'll show you why soon. In the meantime, I'm bored of this place. Let's go to somewhere else. <laughs> I can't remember what they're called, so somewhere else. Hold on, Cara. will be there soon. She's just gone for a shit. Let's go to Sunset Beach, a romantic little corner of the island. Our beach campground offers everything you need for a little fun in the sun. Sounds great. Looks shit, but sounds great. Thank you. Where am I? Oh, just had to spawn in. Sorry. Is Andrew around here or do I just get a new group of sims every time because I'm looking for love? Ah, oh, shit. I said I was going to get my hygiene up down and now I'm getting it up in here. But however, Lisa, you look like you need a wash. You stink. What do you think, Lise? Do you like that? 
No. <laughs> Don't be such a prude, Lisa. Get out of there. You're a prude and I'm pruning, so I need to get out. Hold on, let me just use the toilet load so I can get my hygiene down. There we go. That's some pretty low hygiene, if you ask me. So now I'm going to grab some food from the buffet table. Because if you eat food from the buffet table while you've got low hygiene, it does give you traveler's diarrhea. So just tuck in. There you go. Now I'm going to wait and see if it happened. It's pretty obvious when you've got it. But I can't tell. No, she's not got it. One minute. Let me try again. This is my main aim right now. I have a million plates of food. She has it. Hold on. She pissed herself on the floor, but she has it. She's going to complain about a lot of stuff because I've let her needs get really bad trying to give her this diarrhea. There you go. She has to grab her bum because she's that desperate to keep it in. But that was not worth it, I'll be honest. Let me get in this hot tub because that's the best thing you have to do when you've got diarrhea. Just get into water. Plus, there's a man wearing gloves in the hot tub, which has really brought my attention. Carl can only insult you or talk about my interests because I'm in such a bad mood. But I'll talk about my interests, lords, until you hate me. She won't do it. Her needs are too bad. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Just wear a tent for the night. I'm staying here. She got out of the toilet to piss on the floor, you dirty bastard. Look at her. Janet Titania just doesn't care. She just cleared it up. Go get a shower. Stink. Stop. Just stay in the shower. Or the toilet. Just stay in something. Please. I wish I never gave her this diarrhea. Okay, go to sleep and stay asleep for as long as we can because it's time to move on. She won't stop crying so social solo, but I need to do something fun as well. Let's go light the fireplace. That's fun. Does anybody want to join me or is it literally just me and all the staff here? Oh, well, she's having a great time though. Look at that fun. It's sort of flying up. Not lots. Let me just get everyone to come and sit with me. All the adults anyway. The kids can stay over there. I hate them. I said I hate them. Stanley Squid, what the fuck? <laughs> get away. Hold on, let me stand up. I'm going to scare you. More so than Marky Sharky is scaring me because that is creepy as fuck. Yeah. Very delayed scream, but you didn't see that coming, did you? Oh, nice, Louis. This is very nice, actually. Okay, no one's playing the guitar anymore. You can stop. I'm just going to keep checking this guy out because I cannot find anyone to love me. That was the whole point of this trip. Nah, this isn't going well. Anyway, let's move on. I know there's somewhere else I can go. To the reclaimed public beach. This civic beach has all the amenities you expect from a publicly funded redevelopment effort. Ignore these so-called environmentalists. There is no record of any landfill having ever existed here. We're here and I've got no energy, so I <laughs> don't know how long I'm going to be here for. Let me just keep playing loads of games. I want more baby dolls. I'm letting my needs get absolutely awful here, but I have a lot of tickets now. I'm going to have to spend so much money on hot dogs as well because the food just does not fill you up. <gasps> Carl! <laughs> You're back! Wait, do I even have a relationship with Carl or did he just completely blank me last time? I've never even met the man. I've just created a narrative in my head where I had. <laughs> Alright, this isn't doing much for me. I'm going to buy 17,000 dolls and then I'm going to go back to the hotel. Oh, I can get a guinea pig. I'll do that. Then loads of dolls. I have no one to talk to, so I'm just going to talk to this parrot. If you could please excuse me, Marion. That isn't boosting social like I thought it would. Let me feed you a cracker instead. You bit me, you dick. <laughs> Did someone talk to me? The janitor and the murder both sat here, but they just won't say a word to me. I'll talk to Cal near the shitters. That's sure to get us feeling romantic. Oh, I lost a family friend. I kept kissing him and he didn't like it, but I was speeding through it so I couldn't stop kissing him. This doesn't need to be as hard as it is. <laughs> Why is it so difficult? This isn't working for me. I'm going back to sleep because <laughs> my needs are terrible. It's too hard to keep them up. I just want Andrew. I feel like pure shit. Just want Andrew back, but I can't find him anywhere. But Carl's here again. He's not enjoying the flare. I'm sorry. I don't know why you're being so difficult though. Okay, so he doesn't like me juggling at him, but that's fine. Nope, we're not friends. This is so hard. It doesn't have to be this hard. I'll just swipe other people's food while I'm here too. Save a bit of cash since I've spent thousands while I've been here. <gasps> Andrew, <laughs> you're back after all this time. And I'm exhausted, so I can't even get with you yet. Oh, I weed myself. I hope Andrew didn't see that. Well, I, think he, I don't think he did, actually. I can't see him. And if he's left, I'm going to be so mad. Andrew, get in the hot tub with me. Here we go. Now it's officially starting. Please. No, <laughs> what did we do wrong? What happened? Are we just friends now? Get out, Jaina. Please don't say you're leaving. He's not. Give me a kiss. Yeah, we're back. Everything's all right. Oh, I thought you weren't liking. I thought you weren't enjoying that. A lot of moaning for that kiss. It wasn't very intense. I mean, the kiss didn't look intense, sorry, but the sounds were very intense. Come on, can I get a passionate kiss before the night ends? I'm not waiting anymore, though. I'm doing it right now. Yes. Well, we've got the romance up. I'm going to sleep tomorrow. I'm going to get into Love Me. Good morning, everyone. Is Andrew here? Because I want to take him to the rooftop bar. Either way, I'm going to the rooftop bar. I might as well get pissed. It is 8 a.m., so give me some party punch. That took fucking ages. I don't know how many times I had to press that before she actually ordered a drink. Lovely. Thank you. Yeah, I would be checking my watch too, Holly. That took forever. This is very depressing. It's not doing anything for a fun. She just sat up here. I did a bit for a fun, but like literally a bit. Andrew, is that you? Kevin! 
Stop it. <laughs> Always tricking me. I'm going to keep going to places with hot tubs and I'm going to get Kevin to uh, do stuff with me in it. I'm not going into detail. Who in this car, Kev? Oh, sorry. Oh, I've called him the wrong name. He's going to be so pissed with me. Stop playing with that woman. That would me. Passionate kiss. Straight away. Let's, let's go from where we left off last night. Please fucking move, kid. <laughs> This car is so annoying. Okay, we both love each other. Someone get out of a hot tub. This woman is ruining my trip. I'll try giving you a kiss while we're in there. That might scare you out. Oh, just gotta swap sides for it. <laughs> get out then. Come on, I made that so awkward. Thank you. Oh, she got back in. I fucking swear to Christ. No! She complimented me, so now he thinks I cheated wherever he is. No, Andrew, it was a little compliment. Chill out. Come over here. Let me give you a kiss. Stop giving me the silent treatment and fishing. Two things I hate. Andrew, you've been fishing all day. Okay, he still let me kiss him though. So he's not that bothered by the apparent cheating. It was not cheating. Yeah, he's fine with the passionate kisses. Join me in here. Oh, he's already getting in there. Look at you. Now, play. Gotta swap sides again. Kev. Sorry, Andrew, not Kevin. Sorry. <laughs> but you finished fast then. I am not going to lie to you. All right, hold it over. Let's see how many dolls I got. One. Oh, because she actually is going to drop them all individually. Let's just do this quick. <laughs> okay, not as many as I thought, though. Ten dolls. Oh, and the guinea pig was a guinea pig toy. I thought it was going to be like a guinea pig to keep. I know you can just buy those for cheap, but still. I've met so many people, I don't even know the last names anymore. Um, Andrew Menken. What a beautiful name. Come round. Andrew, why are you still over there? Just come and see me. I'm going to propose marriage. Just once. You'll probably say no, because I've not even spoken to you. <clears throat> oh, God. All the music's happening at once. <laughs> How can we never talk anymore? I think we need to work on our communication before we make any serious commitments. Andrew, that's done nothing for me. You've really turned me off, so I'm just going to wave you goodbye. Get out. And if you heard that, she said, ah, fuck off. So that's how we're going to end it there. A perfect holiday romance and a very creepy fucking doll collection. But that's a good enough summer holiday for me. So there you go. A little sunny escape for us there. I did remember there being a lot more to do in The Sims Vacation, but it was still fun. It's always nice to end a video with someone being rejected for marriage, so I'll take it. But thanks for joining me for another one. There's plenty more like this on the channel if you do want to watch. Please subscribe too if you haven't already. It does really help the channel. And I'll catch you in the next one. So I'll see you then.